stuck. How did you not? Okay. Whatever. Get out. That did the trick. That was weird. Fire! 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 You're dead. I think they both died there, actually. Nice. I didn't even want to. I didn't even come here for the moblins. I was trying to find more of these uh, Lizapos to kill. Bye. All right, switch to Raposa. Hello. It's your girl. Here to save the day. Hey, check this out. I got a new combo. Zap. Oh, you just love to see it, chat. You really do just love to see it. You have to specifically use bombs to blow stuff up like that. You can't just, like, hit it really hard with uh, a combo. That's ridiculous. Did I kill both of the Moblins there? I think I did. Wait, choo-choos? Oh, yes, I need choo-choo trophies, too. Always. That was dumb. Why did you keep getting into it when you knew it was going to explode? Here, explode on that Moblin. Zap him for me. Thank you. Nope. I'll freeze you out. And just get the break and goodbye. Vanish. Fortune is never on the side of the enemy of you, Herbosa. That's just how it is. Please give me choo-choo trophies. Oh, a Malice Guardian, huh? Just just one of these dudes just hanging out, having a good time. Just, you know, doing whatever Malice Guardians do. Oh, the choo-choos are right in front of me. Oh, my word. Herbosa's level 5 combo is broken. Broken is in, like, it's actually too good for the video game. Like, that was stupid how effective that was. It also probably helps that we're in a bunch of water right now. You know what? Take this. Over for you. It also, it hits so much stuff that if, as long as there are enemies around, it builds up the special really well. Are you going to die to this? I hope so. Nice. Later, nerd. All right, what's going on over here, huh? None of you are yellow. How dare you exist without being yellow? I need yellow ones of you guys. That is all I want. Hello. I wanted to see if there was anything over here, like, is there like a reason to come over here and murder you all? Like out of my way? Maybe, like, a boss enemy or something spawns over here later. Zap! I was really hoping there'd be some yellow Lizapos over here, but they're clearly on. I've charged up Ur uh, Urbosa's... I almost said Ursa. That's the name of Zuko's mom. But uh, Urbosa's special is, like, all the way charged up now, so that's all that really matters. Oh, dude, yes, give me more Moblins to fight, please. I am dying for Moblin trophies. Uh, hey, get out. This game is very pretty. Even when it's in, like, super slideshow frame mode. Let's go. Perfectly timed. Get out. None of your nonsense. Hi, guys. Wrong combo. That's the combo I wanted. Oh, hello. You just ran right through all that lightning like it was nobody's business, huh? There's a Hinox over there. How long has that been there? And goodbye. Oh, your weak point card didn't last long enough. Nope. 
I said nope. Out of my face. There we go. Thanks for the lightning, brother. Much appreciated. Really helping a sister out. Coming through. I got a black Hinox to murder. Oh, dude. I meant to do that. It's honestly too easy. I should have used stasis before this. Never mind, unnecessary. I didn't even get to use the like the like the actual combo. I did that so fast. I knocked it into the weak point bar? That's amazing. How did how? Like how'd you do that? Legitimately, I'm curious. Nope. Hey, check this out. I'm gonna do that. And I'm gonna do this. And like you're you're dead, brother. <laughs> Later. Nice knowing you. Hey. Well, that was it. I thought they were gonna have me fight like one last enemy or something. Alright. Easy pickings. Spring of Courage has been defended. Herbos is definitely leveling up here. Teba almost did. Damage to mid-air enemies. No, I want mid-air damage or whatever. Yo, fusion material 250 is great. Got a lot of stuff on Herbosa. Battle experience plus 9%? Oh no, I have too much. Uh, are any of these... Why is this saved? Oh, special attack charge rate I wanted on her, I guess. I don't have anything that uh, sells for a high amount, it seems. That'll do. We gotta mess around with weapons for a little bit. Yo, thanks for the hearty bass. Much appreciated. I didn't even look to see how many of the yellow tails I got. I should've. I killed uh, quite a few Lizaphos that I didn't have to, so I hope we got a good amount of Lizaphos trophies out of that as well. That would be ideal. Ooh, what's this? I need the Lizapost Tales. No, but doesn't Zelda need the Lizapost Tales? This also needs the Lizapost Tales. A lot of stuff need yellow Lizapost Tales, I'm discovering. What is this? Improve odds of higher quality weapon drops. I'm not even going to look at anything else because I can't imagine there is anything in the game right now that I want more than having better chances at high quality weapons. An old man from the Hillian Blacksmith Guild is upset after having an argument with his grandchild. He'd like to smooth things over, so gather whatever the youngster likes for him. Uh, apparently a bunch of frogs and dead animal or dead monster trophies. Sure. There go like all the Moblin trophies I just built up. <laughs> for once... You've done well. After you brought the old man what his grandchild likes, he smoothed things over with the youngster, and thanks, he taught you his secret technique for evaluating weapons. Sure. Was this the Zelda combo? Yeah. Now I just need Lizapos trophies for it, though, as long as I, I barely got any of the yellow tails. There weren't very many yellow enemies there. Defend to call a Citadel recommended level 53. Oh, that'd give me a lot of trophies for Bokoblins and Lizapos, it seems. Anti Flame and Ice. Is it recommended for level 45? Interesting. Anti-Flame and Lightning. I don't even want to think about doing that. This anti-damage trial, you gotta like fight Lionel's Guardians and uh, Hinoxes. Probably gonna try and do it with Impa is my best guess. Would probably be my best shot. Bum, bum, bum. Let's buy stuff real fast. Yeah. Because otherwise I will forget to do so. Oh. How much time do we have left? We got about half an hour, so we can we can still make some progress. I don't think I need to buy anything else from you. Yo, seven nine 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 is the amount of money I have right now. It's hilarious. Uh, wait, no, wait. Do I need stealth pin? I'm gonna go ahead and buy ten more, but now I now I definitely don't need more. Should be good on that for a while. 
always need this. And always want more of this. I need any of these? Uh, it doesn't really seem like it. I'm not gonna buy more of the Sanke carp unless I know I need it because it's expensive. Pretty much good on all these. I'll buy a couple of chill shrooms just to be safe. Because that person is a wandering merchant. I don't like buying guardian parts. I feel like we run into guardians a lot nowadays. I just used a ton of you, so I'll buy some more of you. And that should be all we really need right now. What's this mission? It's ice and lightning. Uh oh wait, is this Sanke Carp? Okay, never mind. I do need to I need to buy ten more Sanke Carp, and I'm pretty sure you can only buy five at a time. Yeah. So I'll take these five and then hopefully I can buy five more from you after this. I really should do this Reju mission just so that it's gone and I never have to look at it again. Probably bonus hearts I'm not super worried about. Obviously we want to do it eventually, but I'm not super worried about it. Really want to get more Moblin and Lizifos trophies to get uh, whatever Teba's. That should be Teba's last combo, I think. I'd really like that. Oh, yeah, and we can get more yellow Lizifos tails from this and more Moblin stuff, it looks like, too. That'd be really helpful. Oh, yeah, I was going to do weapon stuff, wasn't I? Let's do that Yo! real fast. Uh, we never did, we never did King Rome's training level, did we? We should do King Rome's training level. Link, how much stuff do you have right now? You got a lot. What does this have? Special attack damage, battle experience damage per KOs. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty sick, not gonna lie. Special attack charge rate would be nice. I mean, it's plus 6%. What is this, level 13? It's still got a ways to go before it can get high enough level. Is there anything that I, like, know I want? Each part drop rate? No. I'm going to lock this because that's a good ability that I might want to pass on to the Claymore. And then I'm just going to try and level up the Claymore because I'm going to be real with you. It's like the only weapon I use on Link. Uh, yeah, just use that stuff to level it up a little bit. That costs way more way more money than I thought it would. Shouldn't have done that. It's fine. Arbosa, you're the one who's full on stuff. So like, wait, what if, where, where's the weapon you use? Where's your, yeah, the Scimitar of the Seven. Healing item drop rate, damage per KOs, and special attack damage 8%. And then I had something locked for you? Special attack charge rate, yeah. I mean, that that seems like it would work really well with special attack damage. So, I mean, I'm down for it. We gotta get you up to level 20, though. <laughs> so expensive. I mean, I gotta get rid of some of these. I might just want to sell some. Do you, do any of these, did you have any that were like, uh, battle experience 9% is also cool, but I, I feel like I don't have to worry about getting level ups. I feel like I get level ups plenty. Alright, yeah, so like, do that. <laughs> Scimitar of the Seven has over 80 base damage. Seems stupid good. And then you're full on stuff too, almost. Special attack charge rate, attack speed, attack speed. So like, ideally I want special attack charge rate on you. Or like special attack damage. I'm actually gonna lock both of those. I might want one of them. Oh, here's special attack charge rate. I already have it locked. I'm already planning on using it. Well, yeah, in that case, I don't need either of these. Then never mind. I'll definitely go with that. Can I get this high enough to like do it? I can get it to level 18. <laughs> I'm so low on money. This was such a bad idea. All right, that's enough. <laughs> I'm low on cash now. It's fine. We'll make the money back. Uh, let's do. I'm surprised there haven't been any missions over these uh, things. I remember when I was playing uh, Breath of the Wild, finding these like maze areas and thinking they were really cool. Yeah, like right there. It was, uh, I thought they were really neat. There hasn't been anything on this island over here where like Link loses all of his items in Breath of the Wild. I remember that too. Let's do, I kind of want to do the anti, like where's the anti flame and ice one? Grand style barbecue. That'd also be good to get some Moblin and Lizifos trophies. And honey, it gives you honey and Endura carrots. That's amazing. Those are hard to get. 
we'll do that eventually. Yeah, we got plenty of stuff to do. I don't think we're gonna, we're definitely not doing another main mission today because stream won't even be that much longer. Anti flame and ice. So, I mean, I feel like the smart thing to do here is I if I, like, let's play myself. as Mipha because we haven't played as her today, and then, like, we'll also take Daruk as Leave well. To me. Together for all of Hyrule. Yes, together for all of Hyrule, et cetera, et cetera. And then, like, give I them some experience buffs. Actually, I should probably do rupee buffs, but whatever. Quite I should do those on bigger missions. And go. Oh yeah, the king train. We'll do. We'll we'll play as the king after this mission. We'll play as the king before stream ends. In fact, probably this mission and then the king mission. That'll probably be it for today, to be honest. We might have time for one more, depending. But this is anti flame and ice, so I feel like Mifa should resist ice and Daruk should resist fire. Theoretically, Mifa actually could probably resist fire too. I don't know. Druk might be weak to ice. Whatever. The point is, is we're going to do this because I wanted to mix it up and play as Mipha a little bit. We haven't played as her yet today. I definitely feel like, and I'll probably talk about it more at length when I uh, finish the game and like talk during the credits. I feel like one major difference between this game and the first Hyrule Warriors is that I feel like in this game, because all of the... It's not necessarily a... a I'm not trying to say it's a bad thing because I don't think it's a bad thing. It's probably a good thing overall, but I feel like in this game, I uh, definitely am more inclined to want to play as the characters I find more enjoyable, just like more in general, to be honest. I don't really know how to word it. In the first Hyrule Warriors, there were like four characters that I didn't like, and then there were definitely characters I liked more than others, but I was pretty much always good to play as basically any character, as long as it wasn't one of the like four I liked. Or four I dislike, I mean, I said that backwards. But I feel like in Age of Calamity, there's definitely a lot more of, like, dude, there are, like, five characters that I always want to play as, and I don't really want to play as any other character as a result, because I would much rather play the others. I think it's probably because the characters have more nuance to them in this game than they did the first game in general, it feels like. Which, again, I think is probably more of a good thing than a bad thing. It's definitely not a bad thing, for sure. It's not a bad thing, definitely. But I do feel like with more nuance and all, I'm more inclined to be like, dude, why would I ever, like, stop to play as Daruk when I can just play as Linker or Bosa again? You know what I mean? Do you think this has as much replayability as the other Hyrule Warriors? No. Which, again, isn't necessarily a bad thing. There are two main reasons that I think this game does not, for me at least, does not have as much replayability as the first one. First thing is, is it feels like, I'm pretty sure once you finish the main story, the only thing left to do in the game is like 100% this map. And then I think it's done. It doesn't, I haven't seen anything that shows like there are a bunch of, uh, side missions. You can go back for Korok Seeds, but again, that seems like it won't take long to do, theoretically, if you're really looking for them. As opposed to Gold Skatullas in uh, the first game, where that would take a lot of replaying levels over and over again and whatnot to like meet the requirements for them. Also, it doesn't seem like there are adventure maps to like keep you wanting to play to get more completion done. Also, again, this goes back to this game. Like, the characters in this game feel like they've got a lot more, like, nuance because, like, all of their Sheikah Slate uses are different and they've got very different combos, etc., etc., for the most part. Because of that, this game isn't as easy to, like, start playing and then just kind of... When I play the first Hyrule Warriors, why, why? Why are you in this hallway? When I play the first Hyrule Warriors, I can kind of just, like, load up the game and then play kind of, like... It's kind of like second nature, you know? Like, I don't have to put a lot of thought into it. This game requires a lot more thought and focus compared to the first one, which, again, isn't a bad thing. But I do think that means I'll be less inclined to, like, pick it up randomly and play it as compared to the first one, because the first one I can kind of just... I can kind of, like, play it while focusing on what I want to talk about or talking with chat, etc. It's, it's more of a game that I can just play while focusing on something else. Whereas this game, kind of like, if I'm playing this game, it's like, alright, I gotta, like, I gotta pay attention and focus on the game, like, hardcore. Otherwise, I'm gonna end up getting killed by a Lionel. I'm really mad that this Lionel went into this hallway, by the way. 
because like I can can't really see its attacks coming and dodge very well. Yep, see like I, I can't tell what's going on at all. Help. What is happening? It was bomb? I hope it's bomb. It was bomb, but I was too late. Can I get you to come in here, please? Yeah, run in here. Come on. I have no idea why the game's AI had you run out into that hall. That was annoying. Nope. Don't mind me. I do have full food. I was wondering if I did or not. Bomb. Not fast enough. Nope. Uh, okay, I'll take the blurry rush on that. Help. All right, yeah, that literally, I was getting like three frames a second there. That was crazy. Oh, I didn't, my thing wasn't charged, but also he suddenly stopped for some reason. I appreciate it. He realized that my thing wasn't charged and he's like, this isn't fair. What a nice line. Still got to kill him though. 